What is going on guys? My name is Braspy and welcome to Persona 3 Reload. Bro, I'm so excited to play this game. So I know I'm probably late -er than most people on this game, but low key. So I have played Persona 5. I've never played I've played like the little like 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 maybe like 30 minutes worth of Persona 4. I've never played Persona 3 uh and so this is going to be the way I'm going to experience it because I would assume this is going to be the definitive way to play the game. So for the most part, this is going to be okay. Yeah. So I, I know about, <clears throat> um, this music. I, I have some experience with the series for the most part, but yeah, with, um, the, for the most part, this will be a blind playthrough. I don't know anything about this game, I just know, I've heard some of the music here and there, um, and I love the Persona music, especially Persona 5, um, so I, I know some of the music, and I've seen, like, clips in here, here and there, but I haven't seen, like, pertaining to any, like, story or anything, I don't know, so most of this playthrough, it's going to be blind, but, man, let, let's just, let's just get into this, so, normal, let's just do normal, because I know what I'm doing, um, yes, okay, okay, I didn't even know that there was a Bro, I'm excited. I'm hyped. Let's get into this, man. I'm hoping there's nothing in the bottom left corner, because y'all know that's my place. Time waits for no one. All are equal in its flow. All lives born to their ends. You, who would protect the glimmer of the finite future, you have a single year. Go forth and live in the time given to you, even in these halicon days of repose. So, sorry if it's a little dark, by the way. Um, It's kind of rainy over here, so it gets a little overcast, and it doesn't get my... So, hopefully I have enough light in here. Actually, put this down here. I'll move that up there because I have an energy drink, as y'all know. Bro, I'm I'm hype. I'm ready. Persona is a really good series, man. It is. Um, probably my second favorite Sega series, aside from Sonic. I know that might be a little controversial, but Sonic will always be my number one. Hmm. I do know how they summon personas, though. Um, no, there's no way I can't. Your attention, please. Today's train schedule will be modified due to a rail switching malfunction. We apologize for any inconvenience. I do know. I'm pretty sure his canon name is Makoto Yuki. Um, I don't know what we're gonna name our guy. But we'll figure it out when we get there. <laughs> I want. I'm thinking of something goofy, but something like creative at the same time. All right, cool. This is a lot quieter than the Persona Five's intro. Oh my gosh. Oh. Okay. And I do know that every game, there's a different way that they summon their personas and a different way that the shadows come into the real world. With Persona 5, it was the metaverse. And with this, I heard it was, I think this is called the Dark Hour, I think. So I know, I know like bits and pieces about the original. And also because when they advertise this, like enter the dark hour or whatever, that's what it says. So I'm pretty sure this is yeah the dark on, uh, dark hour. I arrived so late, I'd better hurry up. Went ahead and turn on the auto. Yo, these cutscenes are good. Itowai dorm. I don't know if I said that right. That's where I'll be staying from now on. It should be just up ahead. Oh, bro, don't tell me I gotta find the freaking uh, Ginza line, bro. No, do I gotta find a Ginza line? Oh, we're already in gameplay. Run with like that Joker, running like Joker. I should head to the dorm. Okay, let's see. Okay, all right, all right. Ugh. Construction site. Better keep my distance. Looks a little dangerous. Um. Eat a sh strip mall. I. Is this a coffin? I I love how this 
random stuff happens and then like our characters like never question it we're just like all right then head to the oh this is the dorm okay i just got it automatically i don't even and bro's like oh no it's a dorm i guess this is it oh wait yeah oh no <laughs> please don't tell me this is gonna turn off every time man Somehow we made it safe. Is that protagonist plot armor? Persona three, re yo, that looks hype. I'm ready. I'm, I'm excited, man. I'm ready to get into this. Cause unlike with my um, uh, I don't think it's gonna matter. I don't know how many people are gonna watch this, but my uh, my Sonic Frontiers playthrough, bro, glitched the frick out. So I don't know what happened with my mic, but it got disconnected. And so you can't hear my audio at all. So luckily I was just exploring and it didn't affect too much. So I can mainly cut everything out except for the story stuff that I did. Um, but at the same time, uh, that happened for my Dragon Ball Z Kakarot playthroughs. So I don't even know how I'm going to go about that. But anyway, it's going to turn off auto every time, isn't it? You're nice. Right. I've been waiting a long time. Oh boy, here we go. Weird shenanigans. Y'all know how Persona goes. If you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's, it's a contract. contract. Yes. There's no need to be scared. All it says is that you accept full responsibility for your actions. Oh, this is how we're gonna make our name. Alright. I didn't think about what I wanted to make our name. What do we do? What do we do? I want to do something like unique because like this is the first playthrough. So I don't want to have like something like stupid funny and it kind of like ruins the experience. You know what I'm saying? I want to give him like, I don't want to do, I mean, Makoto Yuki's fine. I don't really care, but hmm, you know, okay. I'm going to combine some names of my favorite characters. So, I think what I want to do is for the first name, I'm going to do Izuku. And then for, so as for Izuku Midoriya, and then I think this one will do let's do Kurosaka. Izuku Kurosaka. That works. That, I think that... We'll, we'll, we'll do that. We'll do that. Did I spell that correctly? Go with this. Let's do that. Izuku Kurosawa. I feel like that's that's good. I can do that. Where'd my drink go? It's over here. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Good. Time is something no one can escape. Delivers us all to the same end. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. Yeah. And so, it begins. Ooh. Who's there? Oh, dang. It's her. I forgot her name. You're a shadow. <laughs> Wait. Hold on. I'm, I'm like, I'm analyzing these women, bro. Hold on. Let me chill. Let me chill. I don't mean that in a weird way. These characters are dateable. Mitsuru. Who's he? He's a transfer student. It was a last minute decision to assign him here. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boys' room. Wait, yo, is that guy's uh to be here? I guess we'll see. Isn't that guy's or size uh second year this spring? Just like Yeah. Call me Takeba. Takeba. Yukari, that's right, yeah. yeah. Um, why do you have a gun? Is this the girl's dorm? Uh, nice to meet you. 
Let's do nice to meet you. We're just gonna keep it formal. Keep it formal. You know what I'm saying? Ugh. Ouch. Uh, yeah. Nice. Your things should already be there. Why don't you get some rest? Ooh, can I customize my room in this game? Alright, nice. Yeah, she's just strapped up. She got the strap on her. Here's your room. Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's all the way at the end here. Um, do you have any questions? What's that contract for? Yeah. Huh? Contract? What are you talking about? Ikari doesn't seem to know what I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> uh, can I ask you something? On your way here from the station, was everything okay? Okay, yeah, so I'm looking now. Um, I only cover up a little bit of the artwork, but as long as I'm not covering up the faces, I don't think it's going to be too big of a deal. So, I think I can keep the camera there. Um, what do you mean? You don't know? I guess that means you're fine. Oh, okay. Don't worry about it then. I better get going. <sighs> she... <laughs> But, uh, sure. Um, bro. Yo! My room looking fire! Way better than the room in Persona 5, bro. Life in the dorm starts today. Light in here. Alright. Life in the dorm starts. The room came pre-furnished and everything. Yeah. I'm spent. I should put my things in the closet and get ready. Get going to bed early. Saving your game progress. You can save your progress. In the game by pressing the yeah, yeah, yeah so like in persona 5 uploading save data network by saving your game in the network slot you can upload save data online instead of saving it in the main console storage you will need an account for playstation network to utilize the network slot game d data saved using this method can be transferred between playstation 4 and playstation 5 consoles that's really good however trophies earned during gameplay on one console will not transfer to another console that you transfer your save data to. Keep in mind, certain trophies cannot be earned unless you start a new game from the beginning or with clear data if you have not already earned them. Also, trophies based on numerical values, such as completing an action a certain number of times or attaining a certain amount of something, will be reset to zero upon transferring to a different console. Ah. Rewinding to a previous point. When you save your game, it also saves a little bit of your past. You can go back to that time by opening the menu with triangle, going to system and select and rewind. Yeah, so I heard about this system that was going to be in the game. And it's kind of like, I wouldn't say like the replayability, but it's like, it's like you can kind of just go back to any point in the story. I don't know if it's all the way, but I would assume it's just this little bit. And I heard that you're able to like rewind back so you can like get stuff that you like missed and whatnot. That's, that's what I heard about it. Um... So we're going to see when you rewind, when you select a rewind slot, you will be returned to a point where you could roam freely shortly before you saved your game. Ah, note that the rewind function does not save your new starting point automatically. If you use this function, make sure to continue to save your game as necessary. Ah, all right. You can check the tutorial. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to do any of that. Let's see. Closet purchased DLC can be redeemed by checking the closet in your room. I just put my stuff away in the closet. I did. It's the closet. My stuff is packed away inside. You look at my mini fridge. It's the fridge. There's nothing in particular that I want to chill right now. Mirror. I can see my tired face reflecting in the mirror. I should get some sleep early today. Bro, don't do this to me. It's a heating cooling unit. It's not turned on because it's a comfortable temperature in this season. My study desk. I should probably rest on the bed instead of sitting in the chair. I'm tired. I'll watch TV another day. Ugh. There's nothing on the shelf yet. I feel tired. I should get... Bro. Why am I so lame? Don't do this to me. Okay. We'll go ahead and save Izuku Kurosaka. That's right. Um, sleeping in your bed will allow you to advance forward in time proceeding to the next day. School starts tomorrow.
I should go to sleep early so I'm ready for the first day of school. Hey, I do know that. Hey. Hey, good morning. Let's go. <laughs> By the way, y'all know the deal. Y'all know the deal with JRPGs. They're going to be longer videos. Hey. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Get a girl to do everything for me. Whatever. Yeah. I honestly love the ride here. It almost feels like we're flying over the ocean. Oh, by the way, our school's at the last stop on this line. It's called Tatsumi Port Island. Ooh. Have you heard of it? It's on an island? That's actually really cool. And our school's smack dab in the middle. That's actually really cool. Oh, look. There it is now. Dude. That's actually super freaking cool. I didn't know they did it like, dude, that's really cool. You're like on the island? Morning. Well, here we are. Bro, the Morning. traditional rom-com well, run ahead. I hope you like it. Yeah. The typical run in front of me and smile at me anime style. Y'all okay right? know the music be grooving in this game. Don't leave me. Uh, which class are you in? <laughs> me? I don't know. I haven't looked at the classroom assignments yet. Hey, about last night. Don't tell anyone what you saw, okay? See you. Uh, 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 what? Ah, uh, she knows something, bro. She don't want me snitching, bro. All right, let's see what we got. Where am I? Oh, I'm right there. <laughs> There's a crowd forming in front of the bulletin board. Maybe I'll take a peek before going to the faculty office. Looking around. Okay, yeah, I know how to do that. Focus your view closer in on the protagonist. We'll reset the camera. Wow. Oh, that's cool. Oh, yo, hold up. All right, let's, uh, there's no need for the knit, the post for them to post the names of the kids who are going to be in our class. I mean, we'll never see them again after we graduate anyways. Let's see. Event uh, the, the class rosters are posted. My name is added on a small note off to the side. Class 2F Izuku Kurosaka. Hmm, the name Yukari Takaba is also on the list. It seems that sh I'll be in the same class as her. Okay, yeah. So she's a... Yeah, I figured. Oh, yo, look at the how smooth that animation is when he start running. Whoa. Oh, yo, who's this? Oh. Okay. Kids these days don't know how to show respect for their elders or teachers who live longer than them. <laughs> but Moriyama and her friends had to pull that. Okay. Can I buy anything? No. Okay. This is in. Okay. Um. This is cool. Uh. Oh wait. There's a map down there. I didn't see that. Okay. Uh. Let's see. So. Okay. Yeah. I didn't see that there was a map down here. Men's room. It's the men's room. Enter. I can feel my mind starting to wander as I wash my hands. Whenever I see cherry blossoms in full bloom, it feels like springtime is finally right. Yo, I just went into... Okay. Yo, this school is huge. This is crazy. I can't go in the woman's room. Oh, who's this? Okay, so if they have portraits like that, I do know I do know better to know that those are confidants. I don't know who some of these people are. Bro, who are you? Now, listen closely. A true man <laughs> carried a fiery 
very soul of a samurai within them. Our school curriculum nurtures What? <laughs> what? <laughs> this dude is wearing a whole samurai helmet. That is crazy. Oh, la, la. Who is that? I wish to set my soul on fire and away. I you set my soul on my you know that scene in uh, Tom and Jerry. <laughs> What is this? We'll, we'll explore a little bit. I'm not going to go full on because, like I said, with these JRPG games, um, we're, we're going on a little longer, as you all know, that I like to do that with like Ryzen and stuff like that. But this is going to be, I think, a little bit of a different format only because um, this is going to be a little bit of a different case because of um, how uh, the game is... Um, oh... That must be where my classroom is going to be. Um, uh, this is going to be a little bit of a different case because Persona is like such a big game. So many hours can be sunk into these games. I don't know how many hours is in this game specifically, but I do know that you can sink a lot of hours into this game if you're not, um, you know, uh, for a first time. So the the um, the way I'm going to be doing these these videos, they're going to be a lot bigger and stuff like that. And I'm I'm hoping that's okay with people. I do know a lot of Persona videos um, on YouTube are pretty long and whatnot. Um, so hopefully uh, my series will get enough traction where people want to watch these all the way through. We'll see what happens though. All right, this seems to be the faculty office. Should I go in? Enter. Let's do this. Sorry if I look a little burnt, bro. I, I've been out of town until... Oh. I'm like... Oh. Oh, are you the new student? Huh. Izuku Kurosawa, yeah. You're a second year, correct? They never do say your name. <laughs> Let's see. Ten years ago, your parents... I'm sorry. I've been so busy, I didn't have time to read this beforehand. What? I'm Ms. Toriyumi. I teach composition. Welcome to our school. Did they die or something? Uh, what's your first name is crazy. I'm not going to ask that. You don't do that in Japan. Nice to meet you. Yeah. We'll just, we'll just keep it formal. Wow. Such enthusiasm. Have you seen the classroom assignments? You're in 2F. That's my class. Oh, dang. First, All right. We need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. Come on, I'll show you the way. Let's go. And so, another <laughs> hey, he don't look like um uh Eggman, so that's good. The the principal in Persona Five, um, I forgot what his name Kobayakawa. He looked like Eggman, bro. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> <coughs> the principal continues with the speech. Ooh. Bruh. between you and her. Oh, and uh, does she have a boyfriend? <laughs> Nobody seems to know. I don't know. I just met her. Oh, really? I thought you might know, but I guess not. Wait, how close are you guys? I just met her, dog. Who's that? Someone's talking. Yeah, sounds like it's coming from Miss Toriyumi's class. Hey, shh. Be quiet. You're going to get me in trouble. So, I've heard that you're popular in this game compared to Persona 5 where everybody just treats you like dirt. Oh. Is this the best friend? This has got to be the best friend character. There's no way. Uh, and you are... Junpei. Oh. Oh, I... <laughs> Alright, Junpei. Hey, hey, That's crazy. Here you go again. Acting like everybody's best friend. He's gonna be my best friend. Shut up, Yukari. <laughs> Shut up. Why she got her eyes closed like that, bro? That's crazy. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? Yeah, I know. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. We're not, look, I'm not trying to spit no riz. It's too early to spit riz. 
until we until we meet more of the cast and we see our options and weigh them out, then we'll see. They're kids, bro. That's why. Have rumors been spreading about this already? Now oh, I'm worried. Hey, you didn't tell anyone about you know what, did you? I didn't. I guess. Okay, good. Seriously, don't say anything about last night, okay? Okay. Bro. Listen, I just met him yesterday, and there is absolutely nothing between us. Jeez, I have to go now. There's something I need to take care of for the archery team. You better not start any more rumors. Yeah, facts, bro. I'm, I can't. Ah, who cares? No one takes rumors seriously anyway. Uh, Persona 5 would uh, beg to differ with you, Junpei. I guess I am popular. I am popular. Ooh, excuse me. Uh, dead? Frick, yeah, let's go. I got a new best friend. She wants to take a look around the school while we're at it. I'll just follow you around if you want to leave. Head for the front entrance. Okay. So now we can explore. That's cool. Um, Who we got? <laughs> yeah, wait. Pubescent student. Hey, new kid. You have no idea how lucky you are. You're surrounded by cute girls in 2F like Takabis on. I think this dude is creepy. I'm not, I, I think this dude was a creep. I, I've seen some clips. Um, Where is... There you are. I'm trying to leave. You got to go down the floor now. Would you forget or something? No, no, no. We're good. We're good. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here. Let's check out everything. Let's see what we got going. Um, What are you going... Oh, you're leaving now? You know how to get back, right? Junpei, don't go teaching Kurosaka kun any weird stuff, alright? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Catch you later, Yukazan. Alright, um I'm sprinting! Uh grief. Okay. You've got a portrait and you have a portrait. So they've gotta be confidants. I wanna go up. If you wanna go to the rooftop, you gotta use the stairs on the other side. Oh, rooftop, hold up. Oh! Rooftop, run, 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 run. Let me go to the rooftop. Is Haru Okumura up here? She's not. Dude, this is a big rooftop. Holy freaking frick. This is a big rooftop. Who's this? Oh! I, I'm already a second. You know, she's cute. I'm not. I hope I can fit in with my new class. Who is this? She's definitely important. She's definitely important. I think I've seen some clips of her, but I'm not too. Frank? Okay, let's head down. You, you're here again. I want to go out here to the courtyard. Let's check. I want to explore the school just a little bit. Let me. This one is a lot nicer than um, uh, what was it? Uh, what what was their school called in Persona Five? Um, uh, ah, Frick. What was their per? Yo, this screen is tight. Look at that. Um, shoot, I'm trying to remember what their uh Ah, what was their school called in Persona 5? Um it was in Aoyama Itome. Uh uh I'll remember. I'll remember, I promise. Um is this the gym? Oh yeah. This leads out to the practice field. Okay, we're on to Indoor swimming pool is the gym. Okay. What? What was it called? It was um, shoot. Uh. Ah, I forgot the name, bro. Oh my gosh, I, I've played so much Persona Five, and I can't even remember the the name of the school that they were at in that one. 
it was like it's on like uh, i'm gonna remember it like way after we've already forgotten about it oh 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 oh, oh, oh uh mitsuru oh it's you be careful on your way back i'll be heading to the dorm soon as well don't stay out too late okay 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 so she's here um this center is like really nice looking i like this i also like how the camera like you just have free range of the camera which is really nice because um uh um in persona 5 it was kind of locked and it was like i mean that wasn't a bad thing but it was definitely like just kind of weird compared to this where it's like you literally just have free range of the camera everywhere you go which is really really freaking cool i like that um you ready to get out of here yep cool let's get going okay it wasn't even gonna let me leave anyway what was that school name? I'm gonna... Look, there's a dude over there. Yeah. Uh, frick no. Frick no! Don't tell me I gotta be forced into a club, right? Oh! Hey! <laughs> Yo, this music! Where is this? What? How ma- Yo! This is cool. Okay, I, I'm freaking out about, um... I'm freaking out about, um... Uh... A map whenever freaking, uh... Legit, I have had, um, there's a map in, uh, Persona 5 is just a freaking, uh, phone map, though. Yo, this. <laughs> Yo, I don't, uh, so, I, I don't know if I've said anything to anybody, but, um, I have a fascination with, um, I don't know what it is that I love about it so much, but I love, um, I love, uh, like female vo vocalist in like video games uh or or women that vocal vocal in video games i don't know why i love it so much but it's just like one of my favorite things oh you've got a picture you're important um it, and this girl specifically this lady specifically she did an amazing job on the hey Hey, got me going, running down the stairs. Who are you? I need some takoyaki, huh? Who are you? I'm not allowed to talk to strangers, sorry, bro. Yeah, you're important too. You've got a portrait. Okay, let's go to student dormitory. Dormitory, I said. That's crazy. Who are you? All kinds of shops here at the other wash. Um, okay dorm entrance and then if i go down here i'm guessing i can just go elsewhere right yeah okay so it's more like kind of like air yo wait this is hair bounce okay so this is kind of like that locked thing i was talking about but you have more free reign in the school should i go back to the dorm now return to the dorm let's do it okay so far so good guys we're, we're, ah! How was your first day at school? Oh, is this not voiced? Uh, not too bad. Yes. I see. Well, don't hesitate to ask your classmates for help if you need it. Oh, apologies. I didn't mean to keep you here. You've had a long day, so get some rest. Hey, Lotus Juice on the track. Hold up. We in the lounge? What's up? Uh, I'll talk to you again. What's up? It's dangerous to go out on your own at night. Please refrain from doing so. Said you must be tired after today. You should make sure you get good night's nice rest, bro. Do not be my Morgana, bro. Please. Oh, what about you? Oh, hi. What are you doing? Uh, just looking around. Well, there's not much to see. Well, you're probably pretty tired after your first day, huh? We should go to bed, oh, bro. Can y'all screw off with this? Go to bed early, stuff, bro. That is all persona. Every single daggum time I gotta go to bed early. Can I go in here. I can use computer. This computer and desk owners it belongs to someone. Huh. I like how you can go in there. That's actually such a random thing, but you can. Dun, 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 dun. 
My room. Let's go. It's the closet. My stuff is packed away inside. Mirror. It's the desk provided by the dorm. Tidy when I use it. I'm tired of it, bro. Well, oh, we're not doing this again. Calendar. I didn't even see that one. All right. Let's go to bed again because the game always forces you to go to bed. All right, you do that, confident student. Have you seen the newspapers lately? There's a lot going on. There's a lot going. Oh, is that um, uh, Alejandro Saab? I think it is. That sounds like Alejandro Saab. I might be wrong. Let me know in the comments if I'm wrong. Either way, Alejandro Saab, he's one of my favorite VAs. So. I know he was in this game. I know he was a voice actor in this game. Um... Already. Yeah, so this first part of the game is a really huge like walkthrough of things, so we're really just gonna be coasting for a lot of the first part of the game. But I did want to look around. I can hear people talking. Have you heard? Have you heard the rumor about uh what was it again? The bathroom. What? That's old news besides it's just a ghost story, not a rumor. I'm talking about that one girl, right, the second year. She stopped coming to school and just sits around staring at walls all day long. Whenever her mom tries to talk to her, the only thing she says, it's coming, it's coming. <laughs> That's crazy. Is that really how the story goes? Eh, whatever. It's probably all made up anyway. Some disturbing rumors seem to be spreading around the school. It's the second day! The first bell has... Bro, it is the second day. This is crazy. You would not find this in America, bro. Come on. <laughs> I gotta chill. Not everything is America. Open your textbooks and we'll take a look at the first novel by Zinzo Kasai. Ugh, why him? I've been more interested in Toja Kanai... Uh, Conoco's work lately. His essays are fantastic, and he's also a famous haiku poet. Ooh. I wonder why all this isn't in the textbook. Well, I guess I'll just bring his book next time. Speaking of haikus, they often use words or phrases related to seasons, but it's easy to get them mixed up. For example, you'd think tasty bamboo shoots and vivid carp streamers would symbolize spring, right? Well, they're actually related to summer. Haiku poets usually refer to seasons based on the lunar cat. Lunar calendar making it fairly... Yo, I'm in the middle of the classroom. I just realized that I'm nothing... Yo, look at that cherry blossom out there, though. Oh, my gosh. Um, hey, Iori, are you listening? Here's a question for you. Among these phrases, a rain of flowers, mystical mirage, and vivid carp streamers, which one symbolizes summer? <laughs> uh, uh, psst, Zuku, you were listening, right? Lend a brother a hand. Um, oh, my gosh. So, so sad. All right, here we go. Academics, charm, and courage... So it's not knowledge um, in this one. It's academics. All right. What phrase to symbolize the summer? Um, <sighs> Yo, you got me thinking. Rain of flowers. Let's try that. What even? Nope. I said that vivid carp streamers is... Oh, I didn't listen. Could you please pay attention to my lectures? You'll make me cry if you keep this up. What? Listen closely next time. Bro, chill. By the way, Mystical Mirage and a Rain of Flowers represent spring. Frick, I got it wrong. A mirage is a natural phenomenon that occurs around late March to early June. And a Rain of Flowers refers to the spring showing around the time cherry blossoms bloom. It's not literally raining. Fl I know that. That's why I guessed it was summer. But I don't know anything about Japanese. <laughs> make sure you remember all that. Our next topic is... Uh -oh. Uh, sorry. I ain't letting this go, man. I didn't mean to screw you over. I gave him the wrong answer. Bro, I'm sorry. I, I don't I don't have the cheat from Persona 5. Class is ended for today. I should head back to the dorm. Alright, we're already. You know why Strip Mall is bustling with activity in the afternoon? Don't tell me he's going to come jump me, bro. Please. 
<laughs> Junpei, please. Uh. Oh, he's back. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. So this is our new guest. Sophisticated gentleman. Good evening. My name is Shuji Ikutsuki. I'm the chairman of the board for your school. Oh. Ikutsuki. Hard to say, isn't it? Ikutsuki. Ikutsuki. Even I get tongue tied sometimes. Please have a seat. Oh. I apologize for the confusion regarding your accommodations, but it may take a bit longer before you receive the proper room assignment. Wait, I'm not. This isn't even my full room. Uh, why are you here? To welcome you, of course. You don't mind, do you? Uh. Speaking of which, Takebakun, have you seen Kirijokun by any chance? She's upstairs. As diligent as always, but it couldn't hurt to come down and say hello. Is there anything else? Who else lives here? I guess so. There are only four students in this dorm. You, Takebakun here, Kirijokun, and a third year named Akihiko Sanada-kun. I hope uh. you all get along. Do you have another question? The other night I saw... You saw... Something strange? Like what? <sighs> you were probably just tired. I wouldn't worry about it. Something doesn't seem right. Any other questions? No, I'm good. Here's to a wonderful school year. Now, excuse me. I'm sure you're worn out from all these formalities. You may want to consider going to bed early. As they say, the early bird catches the bookworm. No, they... Get it? Bookworm? Shut up, shut up. <laughs> students? Uh, clever. <laughs> <laughs> uh... You'll get used to his lame jokes. Good. I guess no, I won't. My room too. Like the chairman said, you should get some rest. Transferring schools is a real pain when you're not used to it. Good night. I should listen to them and go rest my bro. Really? Ugh. Next day again, right? Hello there. Oh, hold up, he's in on this. How's he doing? He went to bed a little while ago. He's currently Wait, yo, they're stalking me. Hold up. Mr. Chairman, do you think he's Well, let's wait and see for now. What? What? Okay, so they're watching. That's why they put me in that room, I guess, because they're gonna watch me. I can't leave a pretty girl standing around in the cold like this. Mm, what do you think, Mimi? I mean, I'm cool, but if my parents found out, they don't need to know. Just drop them a text. It'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Uh, it sucks. <laughs> I'm serious. I was scared yeah, shitless. Right. Nice story, though. That was the Bayside Rockers, brought to you by KJ. And that's all for tonight, folks. Tune in again next week, same time, same place. The program you just heard was sponsored by Curizio Electronics, bringing the future to you. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just, I'm, I'm really sucked in. And <laughs> I'm also confused at what's happening, which is most of what happens when I play Persona. Except for, I guess, um... Uh, Persona 5, because I've already played that game. Oh, he's a student. Okay. What the? What's happening to me? transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious to all that occurs then he must be 
As you can see, he's retained his human form. He may be asleep, but he's definitely experiencing the Dark Hour. The only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Well, come to think of it, he must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. Uh. Scary. In any case, <laughs> monitor him for a few more days. Uh -oh. I feel kind of bad though, spying on him like this. Oh, Igor, yo, it's my guy. Welcome to the Velvet Room. His portrait is crazy. Okay, so I liked how his portrait uh, looked in Persona 5. It looks really good here, but I'm also used to how he sounds in Persona 5, and I won't say anything because I'm going to play that game soon. Um, but my name is Igor. the way that he imagines the, the Velvet Room is different from how the other protagonists. Imagine it. She's a resident here, like myself. Please to meet you. Heck, oh. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. Ah, that's the document I signed at the dorm. Yeah, so nobody else is going to know about that except for me. From now on, you shall be welcome here as a guest in the Velvet Room. You were destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my assistance to do so. Hmm. I only ask one thing in return. Abide by your contract, and assume full responsibility for the choices you make. Nice. All right. <laughs> That's, I'm not even a question. I already know, Igor. Velvet key. All right, we've got our first item. Let's go. <laughs> hmm. Feels like I had a strange dream. Time to go to school. Yo, I'm so sleepy today. Times like these, the best course of action is to sleep during class. Journal and rush you get from dozing off right in front of the teacher can really spice up your dreams. I know what you mean. <laughs> it's real addicting, and after you build up the courage do, to do it once, you gotta try it again. Then again, since I'm not listening to the lecture, I'm pretty much screwed later. Yeah, well, okay, so it's called Guts in Persona 5. And I'm just going to let y'all know, I'm not like, I'm I'm Persona fan in general, but because my first game I played was Persona 5, I'm going to be making a lot of comparisons. Not that this game is bad, I'm just making comparisons from each game, you know. So far, I'm really, really enjoying it. And we'll see if by the end of this, this will become my favorite Persona. Oh, but we have classic literature today. That means we're stuck with Mr. Nasty Old Ikoda. Is this the helmet guy? I'm making a guess. No, okay. Ah! Why do you look like that, bro? You look gross. I'm Mr. Akota. I'll be your classic literature teacher. I'll be learning all about good old Japan through some truly great stories. Exciting, right? So, now some people say classic lit isn't re relevant anymore but oh are they wrong the students the other teachers they don't know what they're talking about nobody really understands it like they should i'm feeling sleepy should i close my eyes for a few minutes <sighs> i gotta build that guts i gotta build that courage i can feel the teachers glare as they start nodding off it's like my courage is being tested <laughs> first stat oh okay so we only have three stats in this game. You have five in Persona 5. That's actually interesting, though. So that means there's less to stress out about because in 5, I felt like you had to stress out about a lot of features. But... Sup? How's it going? 
All right. Sure. Uh, where? I don't know. Maybe grab a bite to eat. That's right. You're new around here. No worries. I'll show you. It's just around the corner from here. Let's go. Bet. Let's go. I'm ready. Whoa. This is hey. All right. CDs? And yes, millennials, I know what a CD is. Just so y'all know. Freaking golly, I swear. <laughs> TikTok, bro, is crazy. The Jack... Uh, uh, the Jack Frost. I gotta get one of those for my room. Yo, let me do it. 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 I need to get my uh, drip from my room, bro. I hung out with Junpei for a while before heading back to the dorm. Okay, we got to get one of those, bro, because if it's for the room drip, ah, uh, the room drip, bro, I got to be spicing up the room. Like it's my office on YouTube. You're pretty late. I don't mean to be overbearing, but please don't make this a regular occurrence. Well, in any case, you look quite tired. Why don't you go to bed early? Bro, I know why you're doing that. Maps and shortcuts. Okay. Okay. Um. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like, um, it's like, uh, it's like, uh, uh Persona 5. What that? As there was a dorm mother here once uh, who cooked and stuff, but it's just us students now. Maybe that's why we have such a nice kitchen. It seems like a waste not to use it. Yeah, it does. Yeah, I don't know that I'd really be able to make good use of it, though. And Kirijo Senpai doesn't do stuff like cooking. But I would feel kind of bad if no one ever... Bro, I'm a slow reader. I'm sorry. Sometimes, sometimes... Okay. Oh, look. See how it does that? So this must be a new talking option. I must say, the moon looks quite stunning on this hazy spring night. The tempting as it may be to spend a night such as this gazing at the sky, I suggest you head to bed early and get some rest. Don't worry, there will be more full moons. Uh, it's full moon again! <laughs> um, bulletin board. Various schedules and contact information are written here. There are school printouts and newspaper clippings as well as handwritten signs. The only personal items in the lounge don't make loud noise late at night. Look like the dorm rules. It's the men's room. Let's enter. I gotta use the bathroom real quick before we uh, go to bed, boys. Y'all always make sure you pee before you go to uh, go to bed. Um, whenever I see cherry blossoms, full burn. Okay, yeah, yeah. Make sure y'all pee before you go to bed because if not, you could pee the bed. That's just some friendly advice from Baraspi to the viewers. All right. Ah. Oh. Do not open if open close it okay dude there's so many rooms here third floor second floor why wow, there's so many freaking rooms Sonata's room. Used to be no one inside. Alright, your room. Uh, put my stuff away. I keep doing that like I, like it's going to be like a... Okay, we're tired. Let's just... Um, uh, I was going to save real quick, but I guess not. <laughs> I just fall asleep sitting down. No way, right? Oh. I feel exhausted. Maybe it's because I haven't gotten used to living here. Golly, the models in this game look really good, though. So that's crazy. Just who was that old man from the dream I had last night? And what was that contract all about? You don't know about Igor, my guy? You gotta get you gotta get into the program, bro. Igor, my guy. Bro don't know his persona lore for real. I can't say much. <laughs> it's a... All 
Okay, I was about to say, if it doesn't have it on the screen, then it's inaccurate. But I am laying that same way on the screen. Yeah, there we go. Nothing has changed since last night. Hmm. Very interesting. Even those who have the potential tend to be unstable at first. Memory loss, disorientation. This subject is rather unique. He hasn't exhibited any of the common symptoms. But we're treating him like a guinea pig. Oh, don't look at him like that. The two of you are classmates, right? Consider it an opportunity to have someone your own age here. Besides, we need all the help we can get. Uh, sure. Still. Command room speaking. Akihiko, what's wrong? <clears throat> You're not gonna believe it. This thing is huge. Unfortunately, it's chasing after me right now. I'm almost back. Just letting you know in advance. Bruh. Mr. Chairman, that's enough observation for now. We need to prepare for combat. Uh, right. Be careful. <laughs> Bro's like, all right, just go do it. Akihiko. Oh, shoot. Uh, I'm all right. Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. Oh, dang. Oh man, what is happening? Yeah, but not an ordinary one. Ah, what was that? You've got to be kidding me. Mr. Chairman, please head for the command room. Talk about go upstairs and wake him up. Then escape out the back. Oh dang. We'll stop it here. You're the one who led it to us, Akihiko. So I'm going to have you fight. It's not like I asked it to follow me. What are you waiting for, Takeba? Go! Yo, hold on! <laughs> it's, it's going down. What am I doing? Oh, I'm a, a loud noise woke me up. Oh, okay. I should check what's happening outside. Oh, okay, wake up. There's no time to explain. We have to get out of here now. Uh, uh sh All right. <laughs> I'm not even going to question it. <laughs> Dude, it's Persona, so I'm not questioning it. Take this, just in case. No way she gave me a a, a, a a piece, bro. Short sword. Oh. I thought I was getting a piece, bro. I was like, yo, strap me up. Let's go. Look at my running animation. Right. We should be safe now. Takeba, do you read me? Whoa. Don't make me choose, <laughs> bro. Chill. Don't make me choose. We have to get to safety. Oh, um, not that way. <laughs> Go. <laughs> All right, let's get away upstairs. Let's hurry. All right. Uh, sure. I mean, I'm the main character, so it should be okay, but, um, let's go up. I'm glad I did this early. Bro. Yeah, it did. <laughs> That's the sound of it getting inside. All right. <laughs> Anybody could guess that. On the roof. I've locked the door, so we should be safe for now. All right. Oh, we're gonna get into fight. I hope. I, I want to get into the battle stuff. Oh, yo, full cutscene. Hold up. Look at me. Why do I look like that? Oh. 
Oh. No way. Hey, this music. What? Show me your true form! <laughs> Why does it look like that? One of the monsters that attacked us. A shadow, shadow. alright, from uh, Persona. From the Persona series. Do it! Dag gum! Oh, my turn. Give me the. <laughs> give me that piece, bro. Give me that Glock. I'm ready. Oh, she's gonna die if I don't do nothing, bro. Hold up. Hey, hey, hey. Bro. <laughs> it's time. Let's awaken. Come on. Oh, we got the in the eye thing too. Yo. Persona. Oh, he said it like that. That's crazy. Woo! Yo, look at that! Uh, look at the eyes. Thou art I. Hey, yo, this is crazy. Who do, who is it? Is it Orpheus? I think it is. That's interesting. Wow, Orpheus is his main persona. Okay. Yo. <laughs> why is my why am I smiling like that, bro? Oh, we're getting the uh, the the bigger awakening, I guess. Dag gum. What? No, it's not. It's the that was a DLC persona, but I guess it's the main. Orpheus isn't my persona. It's whatever that is. I do. I forgot what the name of that persona was, but it was a DLC persona in 5. Yo. Oh, do I not get to fight? I want to fight. Let me fight. Oh! Is it asleep? Yo. No, it went back. Is that like it's like true form? Kind of like how, um, Satanile was the true... <laughs> Look at the, the teacher, or the principal guy. He's like, oh. Bro, he's flabbergasted for real. Oh, I didn't even get to fight. Awakened power. Nice. Is it over? Yeah. No. no. Oh, yes, we get to fight. Get away from me. I need to protect her. W, let's do it. Hey, we got a mass destruction. I know the name of the song, by the way. All right, um, let's get into it. Let's, let's do this. What we got? Augie. Let's just attack him. We got a sword. Woohoo! All right. Yeah, miss me. Miss me. I'm the MC, bro. Get out of here. Persona. Boom. Oh, hold up the effect. We got a one more. Let's do it. Orpheus. Weak. All right, nice. Look at that. Got that sword. Bank, 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 bank. The monsters are gone. Nice. All right. Frick, no. <laughs> I'm asleep, bro. You need to. Hey, Takiba. 
Yukari, you gotta get up. Wake up. Here I go. Into the chamber. It's so good to see you again. Yeah, thank you, Igor. After to your power. Yes. My power. <laughs> I would have preferred Arsene. I'm not <laughs> no, I'm playing, I'm playing. Arsene is dope though. I love Arsene's design. Persona. A persona is a facet of your personality that surfaces as you react to external stimuli. You can think of it as a mask that protects you as you brave many hardships. A mask? <laughs> Nice. All right, cool. These social links will foster the growth of your persona abilities. Please remember this. Mm. Now, time marches on in your world. I shouldn't keep you here any longer. Next time we meet, you will come here of your own accord. Nice. I love this persona room. It looks so freaking cool. Like, the jail looked really cool in 5, and from what I, the little bit of I played of 4, there was a car, and that looked really cool, or like a limo, but this this looks super freaking cool. My head is getting clear. I can feel someone's presence beside me. Ah. You're awake. I've been asleep for like a week. Uh, where am I? Thank goodness you finally woke up. Oh, this is Tatsumi Memorial Hospital. It's just a short walk from the station. The doctor couldn't <laughs> you He said you were just exhausted. Hey, um, I'm sorry I wasn't helpful at all back there. But, wow, that power of yours was really something. What'd I do? <laughs> and that power you used, we call it Persona. And those creatures you defeated are shadows, our enemies. Yeah, my ops. Sorry I didn't tell you before. I, uh, I wanted to tell you something. I can kind of relate. To you, I mean. What do you mean? <laughs> my dad died in an accident when I was little. Oh. My mom and I aren't exactly on good terms. My parents are just you know, dead, I guess. explosion in the area supposedly my dad died in the blast but nobody really knows what happened <laughs> he was working in a lab run by the kirijo group so i'm hoping if i stick around long enough we'll find out more about it that's why i'm going to gekukon high and why i was there when this happened to you not that i was much help i kind of panicked that was my first time facing them too sorry you wouldn't have to go through all this if I weren't such a coward. It's not your fault. I was scared too. Really? But still, sorry for telling you all this the minute you opened your eyes. While I was waiting, I thought to myself, I've been hiding so many things from him. As soon as he wakes up, I'll tell him the truth. So thanks for listening. Nice. I've been wanting to share that story with someone for a long time. I'm assuming she has a heart thing on her thing. Um, so I'm assuming she's going to be the lover's arcana. I would assume. That's my guess. Because I know the best friend is always the chariot. So. I gotta say, I'm so relieved now that you're out of the hospital. Don't push yourself though. Do you want to get some rest? Don't worry, your room's safe now. Okay. Yo, let me save real quick. 
Empire Lounge. And yes, um, let me let me tell y'all, I do save over my files. I don't do multiple files because the reason I do that is because I kind of like to have like uh, the most authentic experience. Cur Curie Joe Senpai said she'll be late today. I guess she's processing some paperwork for you. Hey, try not to overdo it at school tomorrow, okay? So the reason I try to do that is I, I like to have the most like authentic like experience possible, which is like so. You know, in real life, you only really have one choice you can make, and you're stuck with that choice. And we, either you had to face the consequences of those choices, or you know, the benefits of those choices. So, in a way, I kind of like to play games like that, where it's like, you know, I like to actually have like um, my choices like matter. So that's why I save over my my files instead of just being like, oh, let me do this and then make a choice. But then when I go back through a game, usually I'll do like different choices and stuff like that to see what happens in different fit save files. But like on my first playthrough of any game I do, I always save over my save file because I like to have like the most authentic uh, experience possible. Um, but anyway, we're, we're going to get going. Um, like I said, we're going to keep uh, moving on with this uh the game because there's nothing good on oh i was watching tv that time there's nothing on the shelf yet oh yeah that's when i get my freaking merch bro when i get my merch i see my normal face reflecting in the mirror should have used the one in the lounge i should rest for today all right at least i don't have a freaking cat telling me what to do 24 7 bro oh my gosh I love the the look of this game. The stylistic stuff is so nice looking. Yo, a long time no see. What's up? Did you have an upset stomach or something? Anyways, I got something to tell you. What happened? Actually. Oh, wait. I'm not supposed to spill. Sorry, man. Forget you heard anything. Bro, chill. She's so much full of energy today. I could hear you from all the way over here. There. Huh? You see, you didn't come to school together even though you're in the same dorm? Uh, I've heard enough about that. Anyway, Kurosaka Kun, uh, are you feeling better? Sorry to hit you with this so soon after you've recovered. Well, the chairman wants to talk to you today. Head to the dorm after school and come up to the fourth floor. Don't forget, okay? Okay. Hold up. Why are you being called out by the chairman? What the heck did you do? It's, not like it's nothing serious. Come on, we're going to be late if we just stand around here talking. The chairman, principal boy, principal guy. Oh, Mr. Ono. Oh okay, this is this is the goat right here. That's enough about mammoths. I don't see the big deal. There's just huge elephants. I mean, you're not wrong, man. Well, that wraps it up for the Stone Age. I'm tired of these lessons about fossils. Oh, yo, if he asked me a history question, I might actually get this right. I'd rather talk about the Sengoku era. Japanese history, not exciting enough uh, until then. Uh, but... It's what I'm paid to do. So here we are. It's not easy being an adult. Facts. Facts. I, I know. Next is the Jomen period. Uh, when did the samurai get their day in the sun? I'll just ask a question at random and call it a day. Hmm. Kurosaka-kun. All right. Uh, the places where people dumped their waste in the Jomen period. What were they called nowadays? Midden's hovels. Oh, bro. I don't have anything I can... Uh, shoot, shoot. Um... Ah, I actually gotta like clutch up. Boneyard seems the most commonsensical, but mm. the only reason I'm I'm going towards hovel is because the last answer was the very bottom one. Ah, oh, we actually have to try with this man. Dang it! Dang it! Um, shoot. Bro. Hovels. Sorry. Oh, I got it wrong. Okay. I bet it was Midden. Okay. At least, dude, if it was Boneyard, I was going to be so mad. The correct answer is Midden. The word is Scandinavian in origin. It means dunghill. Well, I suppose that isn't important here, ultimately. Ugh, I want to get to the age of katanas. Everything else is so dull. I answered incorrectly. Bro, y'all gotta help me out. Morgana! <laughs> That's the only time you're gonna hear me call him out. Hey, wanna walk home together? Uh, sure. I'm not worried about rumors. Alright, 
Okay. Let's go. That's fine. I don't, I don't care. Like, let's go. Home safe. Nice. Now let me guess. Gonna have to turn on the auto again. That's the only thing I don't really like is the auto thing doesn't save. I'm glad you're feeling okay now. Well, I guess I'll head up first. Like I said this morning, meet me on the fourth floor. The chairman should be waiting for us. Hmm. Something shining on my bed, bruh. What's that thing shining on my bed? Yeah. <laughs> Twilight fragment. Oh, okay. That's weird. I haven't seen anything like this before. I should hold on to it for now. That little thing that he's got uh, around the headrest, bro, looks like my desk. Like, my desk has something like that where I can put my stuff under it. Now, I have, like, my keys and stuff like that under desk. The desk is neatly organized. There's nothing good on. All right. Let's uh, go ahead and get out of here. And head up to the the floor. No, 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 no. Yeah, see, like, you have full rotational movement, even in the hallway. That's actually really cool. All right, head to floor four. Oh, there you are. Oh, <laughs> she said, oh. Oh, there's really not that much here. I never even realized that. Like, there's just a huge, big... Come on, they're waiting for you inside. Okay. Oh, is it a meeting room? Ah, there you are. Looks like you've recovered. I'm glad to see that. And look, we're meeting uh, Akihiko. It was that his name? I think I got it right. Hmm. What's up? <laughs> okay. Sorry, I'm getting sucked in. I said that a day consists of more than 24 hours. Excuse me? I was thinking about what to say. I, I... That's a reasonable reaction. However, you've already experienced this truth firsthand. Do you remember the night you first arrived here? You had to have noticed the signs. Street lights going out. Things that stopped working, the inexplicable appearance of coffins. With so many things amiss, didn't it feel like you'd stepped into a different time? That's the dark hour. A time period hidden between one day and the next. Hmm. Hidden. I guess it's more like something people simply aren't cognizant of. Cognizant. And it occurs each night at midnight. It will happen tonight. And every night to come. Normal people don't realize it since they're all sleeping inside their coffins. But that's not what makes the dark hour so interesting. You saw them. Those creatures. We call them shadows. They only appear during the dark hour and attack anyone who roams free outside the coffins. It's hmm. our job to defeat them. Pretty exciting, huh? Yeah. Akihiko, why are you always like this? You just got hurt the other day. Now, now, he does his work well in <laughs> Yeah. I will get to the point. We are the specialized extracurricular execution squad. Ah, for sure. Seize. We're classified as a school club. But in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the shadows. Mitsuru Kirijokun is the leader. And I'm the club advisor. Ah, so she's the leader of C's. On the mind of its prey. The victim becomes a living corpse. Apathy syndrome. I'm sure you've heard of it. We sometimes refer to those who suffer from this as the lost. Hmm. They're responsible for most of the incidents on the news, if not all of them. How do you fight them? Although rare. There are those who can function during the dark hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight shadows. That's persona. Persona. The power you called upon the other night. Yeah. Shadows can only be defeated by persona users. That means you are the only ones who stand a chance against them. I see. I'm glad you're quick to understand. Yeah, I mean, it's a little different from Metaverse, but... 
an evoker for you. Evoker. I'd like you to lend us your strength. Didn't I have one of those in a? Uh... All right, all right. <laughs> Ooh, afraid you'd say no. Nah, heck no, bro. I get to fight stuff. Thank you so much, truly. Oh, I almost forgot about your room assignment. Why don't you just stay in the room you have now? I don't know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> bro wants to still start me. Get out of here. I joined C's to fight the shadows. <laughs> I can hear a voice ringing inside my head. Oh, this is the confidant stuff. Wow, this looks cool. Thou art I. <laughs> Established a new bond, yes. Fool Arcana. Who's the fool? Is that us? Are we the fool? Or is it, um... Seas is the fool. Because weren't we the fool in 5? No. That was... That was, um... Uh, shoot. Ah, what, um, I feel my inner strength growing. Uh, I... Igor. I recall what Igor said about the power of social links. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I Igor was the one. Club activities. <laughs> I, I I just read it out. So tracking terminology, certain terms that have been displayed before in messages, along with their descriptions, can be viewed in the opening by opening the menu with triangle, going to system and selecting dictionary. Ah. The next time he does that, I'm walking away. I'm uh, <laughs> all right. Hi, how have you been? Oh, great. I'm up now. Dark hour. <laughs> and you are? We've met before. Yeah, I know. Soon, the end will come. Okay. I remember, so I thought I should tell you. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> it's crazy. The end. Mm -hmm. More importantly, it looks like you've awakened to your power. Your power. What an unusual power it is. Yes. A power that takes many forms, yet is bound by none. <coughs> Bro, why he got Jack Septicai eyes? Like, look. <laughs> might even prove to be your salvation, depending on where you end up. Do you remember when we first met? I expect you to honor your commitment. Uh, yeah. So is he? Even if you forget about me. Okay, then. See you later. Is he like a physical manifestation of Eeyore, I guess? I mean, he he made us sign the contract, which was an Igor's thing, so I don't know for sure. I, I'm just speculating. I don't know anything. Yeah, I mean, I was sleeping. Was I not? Evening. Looks like I s slept till nighttime. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Dadgummit. Oh, dang! Hey, he's here. Look at the drip! Look at the drip! Yo, she's dripped. I ain't gonna lie. She dripped. Look at me dripped! There's someone I want to introduce. Oh! Hey, hurry up. Hey. Oh, yo! Junpei! Yeah, <laughs> got our bro. <laughs> hey. Are you sure there wasn't some mistake? Mm. I bumped into him the other night. He has the potential, but he just awakened to it recently. Wow. Okay. Oh, nice. That was sudden. You have the potential? 
Heck yeah. <laughs> Junpei. Completely normal in the beginning. Like being confused, not remembering anything. You guys know that? It didn't happen to me. I'm a Chad. It just didn't happen, bro. I'm not. Yeah. Man, I still can't believe it. I had no idea you guys had this stuff going on too. Well, I just joined, to be fair. Heck yeah, my best friend. <laughs> I guess. Well, enough of the introductions. Now that our forces have increased, nice. We gotta go do something. I would love to. I would love to, bro. We could start checking out that town. Yes, finally. All right, we're getting into gameplay. Tartarus. All right, yeah. So I have heard Tartarus. I know what Tartarus is. It's a place that holds the key to understanding the dark hour. Or so we think. And the key. Huh. <coughs> I, dude, I'm ready. This is going to be great. Disconnect. What the heck? Yo, I didn't even realize I was just staring at the like the screen. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Alright. Ready to kick some butt? Heck yeah! I'm so glad I was invited to join. Plus the dorm's pretty cozy. The best part is that we're we're the only ones who can fight these shat er enemies. You seem pretty gung ho. I don't really care. <laughs> That's crazy. Well duh. Who wouldn't be stoked about fighting for justice? Frick yeah. Hey, I know about that from Persona 5. Though, to be perfectly honest, I ain't got a single clue what we're supposed to be doing. We're going to figure that out. So, I wanted to at least get to, like, Tartarus and start, like, battling in, like, a lot of big gameplay stuff. Because most Persona games start out a lot of wall text, walls of text and sitting and just, like understanding things. So, I wanted to... That's why I said this is going to be a long series because a lot of this is, like... Mainly just sitting through text boxes and whatnot. But it's it's fun, trust me. Um, but I'm sure we'll find out. They did say that they'll explain everything. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm ready. I, I want to... I do want to... And so, to get into, like, big gameplay, I want to, you know, go into Tartarus, stuff like that. Nice. What's up, Mitsuru? Dope. Oh, we have an axe talk already? I'll save the details for later. See you there. Damn. Don't waste any time. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't. I like that. Like us. She's busy, you know, with the student council or whatever. Whoa, Yucatan. Do I sense some hostility? It's not that I don't like her, it's just no. Lunchtime after school. You okay? School days finally over. Nice. I'll be waiting for us at the dorm, right? Let's hurry back. I love the the actual like face work. It's so much more expressive compared to um how uh Persona 5 looked. <sighs> finally made it. Oh. And I can't wait till we start getting into the other stuff. Oh no, not this again. Bro's got the flip phone. I know this is takes place like back in the two thousands or however long, I don't know when, but Nice. We'd better hurry to the dorm. For real. 
<laughs> Yo, vocals everywhere. All right. Everyone's here. Let's do this. I'm ready. Let's get right into it. I'm ready. I'm ready. Now, I'd like your undivided attention. I got you. Let's go. For a long time, Kirijokun and Sanada Kun were the only persona users we had. But that number has recently jumped to five. So here's the plan. Starting tonight at 12 a.m., I'd like us to finally begin exploring Tartarus. Uh, so, I asked this yesterday, but what is <coughs> this thing? <coughs> Tartarus. You seriously haven't seen it, Junpei? Uh, I mean... It's no surprise you haven't seen it. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour, after all. Only during the dark hour? Just like the shadows. Interesting, huh? The goal of our club, Seas, is to fight those shadows. However, simply defeating the shadows during the dark hour isn't enough. We must get to the root of the problem. We need to destroy the dark hour itself. Yeah. Uh, Just like destroying the metaverse. You're saying if we run around Tartarus, we can somehow get rid of the Dark Hour? We don't know for certain. Sorry I can't give you a better answer. But investigating the mysteries of that tower is part of our job. The bottom line is, we need more information. Everything we encounter there will be a vital clue for us. Mm. The exploration of Tartarus is of utmost importance. Consider it our top priority. Our society, while remaining blissfully unaware of the shadows, is slowly but surely succumbing to their influence. Mm. Yeah, a lot like the metaverse. The fate of the world rests on the shoulders of you persona users. Mm -hmm. That's one hell of a responsibility. But the heroes of justice will prevail. Yes, sir. It's also the perfect spot for us to train and improve our skills. That place is like a nest of shadows, you know. Whoa, they're nest, huh? But Senpai, what about your injury? Akihiko's still recovering from his wounds. He'll accompany us, but won't participate in the exploration. <sighs> yeah, I know. Dang. Relax. Oh, Junpei's got your backs. I'm not so sure about this. Well, I can use personas. I don't think they can, right? Huh, so he can't summon a persona, but he can. Wait, we're at the school? Huh? We're here? Wait! Uh, what's going on? Why are we at school? Just wait and see. Is the interest of Tartar Tartarus in the school? That's crazy. No way, right? What the metaverse? <laughs> it's like the me yo. I mean, I guess this would make more sense. It's on an island. Wow. Wow. The school is tart. That I didn't expect that. I did not expect that. That's this is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. <clears throat> labyrinth? What are you talking about? What happened to our school? Once the dark hour passes, everything will return to normal. This is the nest you were talking about? What? Why? Why did our school turn into a giant tower? You don't know either? No. None of us I'm really sure know. Complicated. If we don't know, we'll just have to find out. Mitsuru and I have only gone in to take a peek. This will be our first time exploring it. Exciting, huh? There's gotta be something in there. 
Hopefully some sort of clue about the dark hour. Akihiko, I respect your enthusiasm, but you won't be exploring it today. I know. You don't have to keep reminding me. So this is Tartarus. In any case, we decide to enter the tower. I'm ready. Yo, this is... I didn't expect that. That's actually really cool. That's a really, really cool idea. Using the school. It's just as crazy on the inside. But I will say... I'm not going to say that's restrictive. Because like with Persona 5, it was a metaverse. And you had to be in that area. And what they thought of their palace. Because those were palaces. But this is such a cool idea. And this game came out like years ago, man. Like PS2 era. First, you need to get a feel for the place. Why don't the three of you go have a look around? What? By ourselves? I got a persona. Don't worry about it. I'm not asking you to go very far. I'll help you navigate by feeding you information from here. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Need to appoint a leader to make any necessary decisions. A leader? Like me. The captain of a pirate ship? Me. Uh, you can't even summon a persona, so let me do it. Sir, Kosaka. Wait, why him? Doesn't look like a captain. Ouch. Calm down. He has experience fighting already. Wait, seriously? Yep. That's true too, but the main reason is far more simple. Junpei, and you too, Takeba. Can either of you summon your persona without difficulty, like he can? Nope. Yeah, of course I can. Me too. These are shadows we're talking about. Without your persona, you're screwed. Yep. I'm aware of that. All right, let's head inside. Are you ready, leader? I'm the leader now. I'm ready. Let's do it. Ah, <laughs> uh, ah. Uh, let's do this, bro. This music gonna go hard. I'm ready. The velvet key in my hand is shining. What's the matter? Uh -huh. Oh, the velvet room. A strange door is sitting in the corner of the lobby. Ah, so I can visit the the velvet room anytime I want. But I'm guessing to them, I'm just standing there like in Persona Five, waiting, waiting for you. <laughs> I swear, I I think Igor knows, but he just won't tell anybody like anything. And I get it, exposition, story, stuff like that. But you must understand the nature of your power. You must understand the nature of my power. The nature of my power. Oh, your power is unique. You might even say endless possibilities. Oh, Pokemon, let's go. Nice. All right, so yeah, we have the Joker ability, basically. Which I can't even say it's the Joker ability, because I'm pretty sure it started with this game. But I don't know which Persona game it started with. Let me know in the comments. Oh, my bad. I didn't mean to hit them. Best assist you. I already know what it is. It's Persona Fusion, stuff like that. I would assume it operates the same as 5 and 4. I don't. I didn't get to use it in 4, but I would assume it's the same thing as 5. Because in 5, you use it to Persona Fusion, all that kind of stuff. Hey, are you all right? Yeah, so they, yeah, they just see me staring. Yeah. What's up? You look like a zombie. yeah. N nothing. Dang, bro. They don't seem to see the door. Cut him some slack. If nothing's wrong, then let's get going. I had to daydream for a second. All right. Later. Ooh. The entrance to the labyrinth is at the top of the stairs. Whenever you feel ready to start, lead the way. Ooh. 
Utilizing the menu, alright. Yeah. Saving in Tartarus. While exploring Tartarus, you can save at locations where you can change your party. However, you cannot save on the floor you're currently exploring. You can save from the menu by pressing. Alright. Let's go ahead and save because we're at the Tartarus entrance. Who do we got? Is that a bike? Yo. Hmm. So this is Tartarus. Remember, Taco Bell and Junpei have no real battle experience, so make sure you back them up. Got it. Uh, don't worry, I won't push you too hard. You'll be just fine. What is this? Giant device. What is this? I've never seen something like it before. Regardless, it doesn't seem to be function. What is that? Can I run? I can run back here. There's no point, but I can. Clock. What a large clock. It doesn't seem to be working, though. And then... I'm not going to enter. We just got out of there. Let's go. Yes, sir. All right. Are you all ready? I'm ready. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready, bro. School is the first floor. Look at it. Listen to music. Oh, yo, it's 420. It was 420 yesterday uh, as of the recording of this video. It's 421 today. Can you all hear me? Yep. Look, I got the Glock. I'm strapped. I'll be providing audio backup from here on out. Keep that in mind. Wait, are you saying you can see this place from all the way out there? It's my persona's ability. Ah, nice. The structure of Tartarus actually changes from day to day. I'd like to join you up there, but we need someone to provide outside support. That's even more concerning. Now, based on your current location, you can expect to encounter enemies at any time. Hmm. They shouldn't be too tough, but proceed with caution. Alright, nice. I'm ready. Get the hang of it as you go. Right. Got it. I'm ready. Why is she always like that? Right. Let's begin. Defeat all the shadows on that floor. All right. Oh. Okay, so he's got a big old dad gum. He got a huge sword. She's got a bow. I've got a sword. He's got a great sword. That yo, hold on. We are here. We're exploring now. Can I? Okay. So so that's to make the thing go straight. What we got going? Yeah. I see it. Hey, you got it. Ooh. Hey. I know, but... Don't worry, I got it. I got a sword. Nice. All right, let's let's get it. Yo, let's get into this. Purse. Um, muttering tiara. What she got? Whoa, his looks super cool. And then mine's Orpheus. Yeah, she was a lover. Look at that. I got it. Oh no, he's a magician. I thought he'd be a chariot. I was wrong. But we're the fool. Okay. Um, mm, we'll, we'll go ahead and do this first. She said per summon, per summon, summon the persona, so, ow. Come on. He did it! Let's go! Oh, I guess it was good that I summoned my persona because then he got an idea of what to do. Oh, yo, this level up screen looks hype. Yo, that looks so cool. His persona looks super freaking cool. Got it. 
good. Hey, this music is hit. Bro, what? Oh, oh. There's one. I'm gonna hit it. Let me hit it. Another shadow up ahead. Let's get you more accustomed to combat. Yeah, let me hit it. Let's go. The battle's about to begin. Everyone, stay focused. Oh, hey, we got the music going and everything. I'm ready for it's going down now, bro. That song is peak. Most enemies have an elemental affinity that they have low resistance to. Targeting weaknesses is one of the best ways to deal damage. Not only that, you can also knock enemies. Yes, oh, we're getting into this. Come on, you got it. Come on, Dr. Bill, you got it. Come on. There you go, she did it. Nice. Nice! My turn. Alright. <laughs> oh! Boom! Yo, the effects are so good! Let me hit that. Weakness. No. Oh my gosh. The menu's so slick. Everything, dude. Oh my gosh. I'm loving this game already compared to... I I love Persona 5. And the menus in that game looked really nice too. But oh my gosh. There's just something so slick about this game, bro. It's getting me hype. Yeah, you did it. Chill, somebody. Yeah, chill. Great. Looks like everyone's gotten used to handling their personas. Leader, take note of each member's strengths and conduct the battle accordingly. Got it. So I guess they're going to be calling me leader in this game. Let's move on. Yeah. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Yo, this was that was hype. That's super cool. I wonder how far we can go without losing contact with Kirijo Senpai. Oh. Hey, found some kind of boxy looking thing. It's a treasure chest, Junpei. <laughs> yes, boxes like those seem to be scattered all throughout Tartarus. Sometimes they contain useful items for battle. Yeah, the treasure box. You Your typical JRPG treasure box. Yep. Oh, there's an item rarity on it. Okay. That looks like it'll be useful. Lifestone. To to how to use it. Using items and skills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I know how to do that. Um, skill item. Restores. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look at these screens. Oh. Dude. These screens! <laughs> that is so... Oh, that's so clean. Item. Skill. Dude. Oh, she can heal. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. These screens look so clean, bro. Oh my gosh, hold on. Let me look at the red. Okay, social link. Oh my gosh, I love the look of those screens. That's really clean. Now right, let's move. Yo, is this really a school? Like, no joke. But it'd be kind of funny if we were actually inside our classroom right now, huh? Um, there was a, a treasure. Okay. These, uh, the, the map is a little like. Oh, let me fight it. <gasps> Shadow detected. Looks like they haven't noticed you yet. Now's your chance. Oh, surprise. Yeah. Types of attacks and encounters. You can swing your sword by pressing square while exploring to slash an enemy. Doing so will start combat. Striking an enemy from behind will trigger a chance encounter where you have the advantage at the start of combat. If the enemy attacks you first, a pinch encounter will occur, placing you at a disadvantage. Get into the habit of initiating chance encounters to gain the upper hand for an easy victory. You can still swing your sword even when there are no enemies present, so you'll be able to practice and test your sword's range. Watch this. 
Oh, we got it! Yes! Oh, we got it! Hey! Hey! Disturbing the peace! Oh my gosh, so good. It's not only the things you were looking about. <laughs> it's so good. Yes, the all out attack. Oh my gosh, it's going down now. So pink. I'm ready. All right, all out attack. I know how to do it. Um. Kill him. All right. Hold on. We got it. We got to hit it on the. We got to hit it on the. We got to hit it on the. Oh. Let's go! Yo, on beat. So good. Shuffle time after a battle is once shuffle time may occur. During shuffle time, different types of cards formed by the possibilities within your soul will appear. You can choose one of these cards. Each type of card has a different per Oh, so this is how you get personas. Wind increases experience, activates battle support effects, obtain a skill card, obtain my Ah, the one more the more one mores you get in battle, the higher the chance shuffle time will occur if you end a battle with an all out attack. Shuffle time will always occur. Ah, high priestess. Yo, done and dusted. That artwork is crazy. Ah, so we got our next persona. Oh, and you can heal too. How'd you like our all out combo attack, you filthy shadows? <laughs> saw my opening? It's like my body just knew what to do. That was magnificent teamwork. It's hard to believe it's your first time. As you grasp the flow of battle, you'll learn to coordinate with each other seamlessly. Yo, uh, with music too? So far and continue exploring. Ah. That was so good. Oh my gosh. Disturbing the peace. Y'all don't know about disturbing the peace, bro. Oh my gosh. Dude, the music is so good. Hold on. I'm going to sneak up behind him. I detect another shadow up oh, okay. Take advantage of what you just learned. Try not to alert the enemy as you move. I'm guessing dashing won't alert the movie. The movie, I really just said that. Hey, uh, get out of the way. Or is this a thing where it's like, oh. Disturbing the- Yo! Okay, so if you sneak attack them, you can get this good one. Mm. Ooh. Do I have control of every character? You, my boy. Nice. Why am I remembering this? <laughs> okay. I can feel a new potential within myself. If you have multiple personas yet, change. Ah, the music. Orpheus. Yes, Priestess. Let's hit him with that Bufu. We don't know what it's going to do, but we'll hit him with the Bufu. Oh, it's weak. Yep. Nice. Yeah, I got multiple. What to do? Nice. Woohoo! Look at that. Coins, wands, XP acquired. Holy arrow. 
Okay, HP we're good with. Um, let's do this and get Holy Arrow, I guess. Disturbing the beast! Yo, that's gonna get stuck in my head. I like how he just goes back to putting his hands in. Well, it looks like he has the ability to summon different personas. I suspected as much after the events from the other day, but now we know for sure. Hmm. Because of the other persona that we got. I think it's a good place to stop. Okay. There's a device nearby that will teleport you. Uh, look around for it. There should also be some stairs nearby, but I can't approve any more exploration right now. We'll explore the upper floors next time. Occasionally, you will encounter one-way teleporters and tartars that can be used to return to the entrance. Keep in mind that since these teleporters are only one-way, you cannot return to the same floor where it was used. Ah. Ah. That's interesting. Oh. I want that golden chest. Look. That treasure chest looks different from the one before. Yeah. Yes. That particular box is sealed in a special way. The box can be unlocked by its own mechanism, but it needs something else to work during the dark hour. Hmm. The twilight fragment I found in my room seems to be reacting. What's that you got there? I wonder. Following up is ah, yeah. So if we have twilight fragments, I guess. Number of twilight fragments I have one. Using one should open it. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me that. I want that chest. Snuff Soul, too. I thought that that's a Twilight Fragment. They can be used on devices throughout tar Tartars. You might find more in Tartars or other locations with traces of shadows. If you come across any going forward, you'll want to take them. Alright, nice, 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 nice. Where's the teleporter? There it is. I did want to go... Looks like you found a teleporter. Nice. Nice. Yeah, let's head back. I'd love to continue exploring, but... Oh, yeah, okay, that's what that is, yep. Welcome back. Thank you. So, <laughs> how was it? No problem. I see. Well, if you gained confidence, that's the best thing you could have achieved. Wow! I never knew I had that kind of power. Damn. Why do I feel so exhausted? Because you were bouncing around like a little kid. You say that, but you look pretty tired yourself, Yukatan. This is different. It's like I'm having trouble breathing. What's going on? Mm. That's the effect of the dark hour. You'll become fatigued more easily. Don't worry. Ah. You'll get used to it. I have to say, though, I'm surprised. You all did much better than I expected. At this rate, they'll catch up to you in no time, Akihiko. Is this dude overpowered or something? We'll see about that. By combining my powers with the teams, I was able to stand against the shadows, since a strong bond with them. <coughs> nice. Rank up on fool again, yeah, sees. Just like Yukari and Junpei, I feel tired as well. I decided that it would be best to return to my room and rest. Okay. Um, let's go back. Not bad. Excellent work. I have high hopes for our future expeditions. The Dark Hour will be ending soon. After returning from Tartarus, the Dark Hour will end. This will start the next day. Use this time wisely to recuperate for your next expedition. The structure Tartarus will have changed by your next expedition. Treasure chests will have already found. You have already found can be rediscovered as well. So returning could be a good idea if you find yourself stuck. Let's finish up here. Does that sound good to you? Let's call it quits. We're pretty much done. All right. Rest up and come prepared for our next expedition. Yo. Hey, you're in 2F, right? What's with that wary look in your eye? I'm Kinji Tomochika. We're in the same class. Morning. <laughs> Yeah, you too. I heard from Iori that you're pretty close with Takabasan. Is that true? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I'm looking for someone with a little more experience anyway. Oh, crap. It's almost time for morning assembly. Come on, we better hurry. Bro, that is crazy. That concludes the main portion of today's assembly. Next, we'll hear a word from the student council.
console. All right. Please welcome the new president, Mitsuru Kirijo from Class 3D. Kirijo. Thank you. I think I said it wrong, but you know who cares. <laughs> so she did get elected. Well, I guess she is the most popular girl in school. You can say that again. She's got this intimidating vibe around her. Not to mention, this school's owned by the Carrillo Group, right? As I begin my term as student council president, I'd like to share with you my vision for this coming year. It is my firm belief that each of us must accept the responsibility of bettering our school. However, change cannot occur without sustained effort and an unprecedented level of commitment. Hmm. That is why we must restructure our daily lives in order to rise to this challenge. I'd like each of you to dig deeply into your well of motivation and reevaluate your convictions. Strive to imagine a bold new future without losing sight of the realities around you. That is the key. My own ideas are but one person's vision. For us to reap the full benefits of our education, your participation, opinions, and enthusiasm are essential. Thank you. Dang. What a speech. Do you, uh, have any idea what you uh, just said? Genuinely, no. Sort of. Sure didn't sound like something a high schooler would say. If it was anyone else, we'd be laughing our asses off. Probably. He's not wrong. Afternoon. Oh my gosh, the game lagged. Okay. Alright, well. today we'll be looking at some Meiji era literature. Open your textbooks to page 12. You know what? I'm sick of this story. I already went over it the last class. I've got a great poem we can discuss instead. Close your textbooks, everyone, and listen to this. Isolated clouds suspended over the tall, snowy mountain peak. I'm feeling sleepy. Should I close my eyes for a few minutes? Hey, let's get them. I can feel the teacher's glare as they start nodding off. It's like my courage is being tested. I'm going. I'm going for it. Yeah. Timid. That was boring as frick, bro. I don't... <laughs> I don't do school. I don't do school. Yo! Wanna stop by Paulonia Mall on the way back? Might wanna stock up while we can. Since we got stuff going on at night. And there's a pharmacy there, too. Couldn't hurt to get some meds in case anything happens. Seem really into this. Chairman said it himself. The fate of the world depends on us. Let's go, leader. First task, escape from the school. Look, it's the Sonata Senpai! Dang, bruh. Have you noticed how popular Sonata San is with the ladies? I guess neither of us really got to know him before all this crazy stuff happened. He's a captain of the boxing team. Never boxing? No wonder he likes fighting so much. Who would have thought boxing would turn you into a chick man? I mean, come on. I mean, he's probably ripped. More than a harem mug. I wonder where they're going. Hmm. Hey, are you guys free this afternoon? Huh? Yo, let's go. What about the fate of the world? Ah, don't be lame. Even heroes need some rest now and then, you know? Shut, shut up. He sound like Ryuji. Yeah, of course. No problemo. I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. You know where it is, right? I'll be waiting at the police station. That's where we were going to go. The police station? You mean, we're not hanging out with friends? Who? <laughs> These girls? No, I don't even know their names. Hearing so much chit chat gives me a headache. <laughs> anyway, I'm going on ahead. Don't keep me waiting. Hey, we're in with the cool kids. Let's go. Bro, I don't even know their names. They're random NPCs. Let's let's chill out. Sonata asked us to meet him at the 
Polylomia Mall PlayStation. June time. June pie. June pay. And I decided to head over. Bro, oh my gosh. I can't speak. I was just headed there myself. You know the place, right? Let's go. Um, can I save? I can. All right. All right, I think I'm going to leave it there for this episode of Persona 3 Reload. It was a long episode. I'm already like two hours, ten minutes in now. So I'm going to take a break because i got to get some other videos recorded. Um, especially since, oh my gosh, first of all, this freaking music. Um, second of all, because, um, yeah, like I said, i, I got to do editing. And this video is going to take a while to get out there for two hours. So, um yeah hey if you guys did like this video please make sure to leave a like on the videos it does help out a lot and lets me know that you guys are liking what i'm putting out as well as hey um let me know what you guys are thinking of the series thus far and thank you so much for 300 subs um uh, you know it's only up from here um and i wanted to start this uh for 300 subs i wanted this to be like the commemoration of that persona 3 300 subs uh so um you know, and I'm hoping that this series is going to really pop off and people are really going to enjoy it, especially since it's a blind playthrough. Um, and it's going to be a long one, but I'm, 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 I'm here for the ride, man. I love Persona. Um, and so far, I'm loving this game. It's really awesome so far. So I can't wait to see what the rest of the game has in store um, for us, as well as, you know, it's not going to be it's not going to be every so often. You know, it's, it's not going to be like all the time, but um, hopefully... Um, I am going to have to do some rework because like I said at the beginning of this recording, uh, some stuff happened with uh, my old, my uh, my two other playthroughs. So I'm really going to have to figure out how I'm going to get this stuff out. So I might have to do some persona in the meantime to uh, compensate until I figure out what to do with that. But yeah. And hey, if you're new around here, subscribe so you don't miss a single persona three upload because we're going to be playing through this whole game. I don't know how long it is, but we're going to be playing it. It's going to be fun, and I'm so ready. As well as Sonic content, we're playing Sonic Frontiers right now, um, or I'm revisiting that game, and we're playing that right now, and that's a super freaking fun game, and um, I'm ready to do that. As well as Italia Rise of 3, we're playing that, and Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. So a lot of anime and Sonic stuff, as y'all know, I, I really like doing that. But we're also going to... Uh, don't worry, I'm, I don't do explicitly anime. I've played Spider-Man before and um we'll we'll probably play some other games at some point um i'm just heavy on like anime video games right now like it's like my phase that i'm in right now so it's just whatever but uh i'm gonna quit yapping um and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye <laughs>